Over the years, I've had several people who are gifted in the realm of maybe mediumship or psychic gifts who have told me that I have a very large group of beings with me. And in the past, I've always just like, okay, that's cool. That's interesting. And, but in, in the phase of evolution that I'm in right now, what started happening for me about a week and a half ago was that I was wondering why. Why? Why are these beings with me? What does it mean? And so I turned to a friend of mine who's very gifted in this, in this realm. And uh, what she revealed to me, so the revelation that, that hit me, was really surprising and deeply touching and has changed me. So the first thing that she, she said, well, just so you know, you called them in. I'm like, what? How'd that happen? She's like, well, I got a vision of a young girl, about eight or nine, a tomboy, I'm assuming that's you, in the woods. And as soon as she said that, I knew exactly when, when I called in for that support and that was a time in my life when I actually had undergone the biggest trauma of my life. Many of us have had experiences like that. And I was just blown away by receiving this, this information because one, the first thing that happened for me is that it touched my heart. I'm like, oh my God, how much does God love me? How amazing is this, is that I could call out, and I'm thinking, I'm, I'm not really sure that the little girl knew how to do that, but me, the being, did. The being that inhabited that little girl at that time. And this information continued to move in really powerful ways within me the night that I went to bed after receiving this information because it was moving with me all day, I just burst out into tears. It was like that was the time when I could like let it all go. And also the tears were tears of gratitude as I communed with this group of, of beings who is God. <laughs> we are all God. We are ind individualizations of this one presence. And so just giving that, that uh, gift of gratitude and also bringing into my awareness and sending that love to that previous version of myself who did not know how to really work with what had happened to her. And then what happened for me throughout the week, the coming days, was I kept getting these revelations. I kept seeing in the field like something would light up a point of time in my life when that presence of support and guidance and protection showed up for me, sometimes in dramatic ways. And I'm left here now. You know, what, I, what I've noticed is, is in, in this revelation, there's been a, de a deepening, an opening to this powerful experience of love coming to me from the invisible. What I noticed last week is that, that I was more capable of bringing that, that presence of love into my life, into the whatever I was doing, a gentleness, a kindness, a compassion, a level of it that was not previously expressed by me.